Well, on the night beat a Christmas Day tragedy, bringing together a family as they mourn the loss of their loved one. 28 year old Roxanne Sanchez was shot and killed by her boyfriend. The night team's Bill Barajas sat down with her family this evening. Stockings and a Christmas tree are just a small part of the Sanchez holiday celebration. Festivities that would be cut short come Christmas morning. By 1026, she was pronounced dead at the university hospital with a gunshot on her chest. Police say Roxanne Sanchez was shot during an argument with her boyfriend, Benjamin Pullman, at their home on the 4300 block of First View Drive. Even my grandson said, I mean, Grandma, what a Christmas gift is this? My mommy's gone. He took my mommy away from us, and I said, well, you know what? Your mommy's up in heaven now, and she's looking down on us. Elizabeth Rodriguez says it wasn't the first time Pullman had become violent with her daughter. Why did he have to take my daughter like that? We do not know. She, she, was, tired, she was tired of all the She was abuse, tired of him. Abusive. Yeah, she was ready to come home. Sanchez leaves behind four children who range in age from 2 to 12. She was uh, full of life, beautiful woman, beautiful mother, daughter, sister, aunt. The shooting is still under investigation, but Sanchez's family says they want justice and will lean on each other and their faith until they get it. They have no mommy now because he took her away from them. So yes, I, we do want justice done. Um, and I just hope he doesn't come out at all. Bill Barajas, KSAT 12 News. The Sanchez family will be holding a fundraiser tomorrow to help pay for Roxanne's funeral and to help her four kids. It'll be held at the Night Owl Club located at 1843 Rigsby Road starting at noon.